All right, we are at Cosley Zoo, and today we're gonna check out domestic animals and wildlife native here to Illinois. So, let's go! Oh no! Welcome back Chronicles crew, you have Carl here. If you're new to our channel, we're a family travel vlog. We love to go to local spots, tourist attractions, and weird and quirky places. We hope that our channel will inspire you to check out what's around your area. We may go to a lot of places, but a lot of places we go to either low cost or free. So for example, here in Cosley Zoo, it was $7 just for me, and then for Addison and Rosalie, they were free. 17 under are free. Yeah, it's too bad that Melissa wasn't able to join us. She's feeling a little under the weather. With the local animals here in Illinois, this is really a great place for the kids to be able to get up close and personal and to be able to learn about their natural habitat. These are Nubian goats, and you can tell because they have floppy ears. Some of the exhibits are closed because usually it's for like winter time, but we're having a blast enjoying this good weather. But I think in a couple of days it's going to snow again. So Cosley Zoo is located here in Wheaton, Illinois, and there's about five acres of land. In November 1973, Paula Jones donated this land, about 2.65 acres. So by August 1974, they opened up Cosley's Children Park and Museum. And by 1999, it was named Cosley Zoo. And then we ran into the raccoon exhibit. I could not look at these guys in the eyes. <laughs> if you're a huge raccoon fan, I would not click on our video titled Delafield Coon Feed. <laughs> Don't say they warn you. So our channel, we love to interact with our fans. And one way we do that is sending monthly postcards to our Patreons. If you're interested in that, go in the description below and find out how you can be able to do that. One of the things they do is rehabilitate animals and then be able to put them back into the wild. So behind me are, you know, one of the stations they use to be able to do that. It's been a very special weekend because it was Addison's birthday! Happy 12th birthday, Addison! Hey, in the comments below, wish Addison a happy birthday. I really can't believe Addison's grown up so fast. Right now, she's really big into basketball. I think she's gonna start playing soccer and also volleyball pretty soon. And yesterday, Addison hit a chocolate piñata at Uncle Julio's. That's the way she wanted to celebrate her birthday. So I've really enjoyed watching her uh, grow up into the young lady that she is. I can't believe I almost have a teenager. <laughs> Ed is such a great big sister and such a role model for Rosalie. These two are two peas in a pod. Llama <laughs> Llama Red Pajama. For those viewers that's been here before, uh, I got a question. There's a lot of CDs hanging out on trees. Do you know why that is? Or are CDs death worthless now? That they're just made as ornaments for trees to entertain the animals. <laughs> oh no! How do you look my new panda hat? I got it from the Hangar Black Panda. Check out his channel. It was amazing I finally got to meet up with the Hungry Black Panda a few months ago. Please visit his channel and the link will be down below in the description. Let them know Santos Chronicles sent you. For those that saw our Klein Creek Farm sheep shearing episode, uh, it was able to do it through scissors for like the 1800s. I like how you're so close to the animals and how like it's really natural. All right, we are now done here with Cosley Zoo. We're about to head on home. 
Hey, check out the end cards for other videos that we do have. Make sure to like and subscribe to this video down below. And hit that notification bell while you're at it so you know when a new video comes out. Till our next journey. Bye!